so today I'm gonna go for a country walk with my friend Kirsten. So I have a feeling that this video is probably gonna be more of a vlog style. Um, I hope it works out, but yeah. I'm excited. It's going to be a good day. It's actually nearly 9 a.m. I'm running late. We were supposed to be out the door at 8.30. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd quickly pop on here and say hi. To give you an idea of what I'm wearing, it's so cold today. Um, I've got my Hunter Wellies, two pairs of socks, like a one pair in there and then this pair out here. A pair of thermal leggings underneath my jeans. Um, my jeans, a thermal top a jumper, this really cool thing which actually holds a lot of heat. I then have my skirt, uh, my skirt, I then have my coat, my scarf, and of course a warm hat. So yeah, I think I'm going to be properly warm. Um, I think it's going to be something like 3 degrees uh, today Celsius, which is like what, less than 40 Fahrenheit? I, I don't know. Whatever it is, it's cold. But running late, so we gotta go. Gower. Um, this is a cute little village in the Cotswolds. Um, yeah, ignore that voice. That's cousin. She's not actually going to be in this video because she doesn't want to be in this video, but that's okay. Um, I totally understand. So it's just you're just going to have me to entertain you. Yeah, sorry about that. Actually, doing a six mile walk. I thought it was going to be nine, but yeah, it's going to be six miles, green lanes, field paths, easy but muddy. So it's a good idea that I've got my wellies on. Um, so yeah, this is where we are. Got a little map here for you. So yeah, we are over here. Little start, and we're gonna go for a walk all the way around there. So, very excited, very excited. Okay, so let's go. So quiet, and look at the scene. Guys, it's so pretty here. Um, yeah, as you can tell, it's so cold. <laughs> I've got my hat. And the biggest scarf in the world, which if any of you guys have watched my cozy travel essentials, you'd recognize the scarf. Um, and yeah, we're just figuring out which way to go from here. So, I think it's going to be a very good winter walk. It's a little sign there. Yeah, first stop, bird drop. Let's go. It is because it would say footpath. Oh, there That's you go, Kay. Okay. Look at that. Okay. What are you doing hiding? Let's go. Footpath. No, Did it say footpath? Yeah, it's a little right away. Okay. Fantastic. It is. So here we go. See, these are like, this is the little signs we follow. It's like a little treasure map. I wish I had like my big lens so I could sit and just zoom in. It's such a cool shot. I had a feeling it was here all along. See, Kirsten, you should just follow me. Huh? You should follow me. I had a feeling it was there all along. We're doing a little check in. Do you I'm mind? Well, thanks. A bit muddy, but such a beautiful day for it. Such a beautiful so day. Beautiful. Would you say? Absolutely gorgeous. It's really gorgeous. 
a really beautiful day for a walk. Oh. It's so much better than the photo shoot I had last week where the weather was dismal to say the least. It was so wet and raining. But you know what? I'm pretty sure the pictures will turn out even better for it. So it's always, it's always a positive. Hey, you're a good friend. Why are you running away? How are you doing? Oh no! No! Come back! This... I had no idea she was so skittish. High school friends, hey? Can't trust them. Can't trust them. Wait, wait, what do you say here? School friends. School friends. Kirsten's telling me off because she thinks I'm turning into an American. Yeah. Have a good day. A lot of these country walks are essentially just intuition, like following your intuition when you're crossing over fields because there's not really a sign. Um, and you just have to like look for little arrows on the gates or little footpath signs, but it's just really interesting and actually kind of fun. I don't think I could do it myself, I would get terribly lost. Um, especially because when you're in the country you don't have much signal sometimes either. But I'm with Kirsten and yeah, girl has good instincts. What can I say? I thought you might be interested. Yeah, I love stuff like this. So we've just finished our walk and we're actually looking for a nice place to go get some food, um, which I'm quite looking forward to because I'm hungry. Look at this tree. Oh, <laughs> oops. No, look at this cottage. Getting in everyone's way. Right, mix up food. Hey guys, so we finished our walk and we are now in 
in this really beautiful little village and I decided to swing by here and just get ourselves a nice meal because we walked a lot today. We we'll start in... <laughs> Pub lunch. Oh, lunch is sweet potato fries, carrot and sweet potato soup, and gluten free toast. So get in my belly. Now, you know a place is good when they stock handmade chocolates and macaroons. Oh, this looks so pretty. So nice. Oh, look at these silver ones. So excited when it comes to flores. Oh, I really like these guys. I think I might have to make a shoot with these. How much are these ones here? The ones that are still, I can't remember their name. Uh, eucalyptus. Eucalyptus? Yeah. Uh, these are two, I think it's 220 stem. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> Okay. Alright, well, it's good to know you're here. Okay, thank, thank you. Bye. Bye. Ooh, where's Kay? I see her. This is what I saw from the door. Oh, it's a book of cat pictures. So yeah, for well, those of you who like cats. Oh my god. What is that? Cat dingo. Who can we buy that for? Oh, that's funny, it's Christmas present. It's look amazing. Yeah. I God, I wish I knew people for like guinea pigs. This is amazing. Christmas time. Oh. How'd you like it? It's okay. Guys, for those of you who like cats, I must get. Back at home. Today was a really good day. I feel exhausted. I haven't actually started editing this vlog yet, and it's going up today. So that was not very well managed. Um, yeah, the video I had planned for today actually didn't work out. Uh, that's okay, at least you try these things, I suppose. Um, but yeah, today was a really good day. I had a really lovely time with Kay. It's been a really long time since I've taken a day out just to walk and like walk about and just be in nature. Um, yeah, that was just highly recommended. So if any of you guys just need to clear your head a little bit and just take a day. Yeah, it's okay. Nothing, nothing it's, okay. it's okay. We'll make it up for it anyway later. Um, but yeah, worth it. I'm so pleased that a lot of you guys entered for the giveaway in yesterday's video. So I'm just going to pull that up now. And let's see how many people's comments. There's 35 comments. So I'm going to pick two winners. So I'm going to go to that like random, there we go. Randomizer, bookmarked it. You know when you wear a hat all day, your hair is just like flat underneath? Yeah, it didn't look very good. I was like, I, I need to put another hat on immediately. Yeah, I'm trying to make the most out of all of my Christmas hats and Christmas stuff before it's finished. I'm so sad, there's only a few more days to go till Christmas. Um, am I the only one who's like wishes Christmas was actually at the end of January or maybe even like February? Um, just because the run up is so nice, like, yeah, I really enjoy the run up to Christmas and just like that festive spirit and those festive vibes. And then January hits and you're like, oh my God, back to reality, back to real life. Am I the only one? Or, you know, some of you guys like, yeah, can't wait for Christmas to be over and done with, I'm tired. Um, yeah, let me know, let me know in the comments so I know whether you are a pro Christmas or a not so pro Christmas person. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm gonna randomly pick 
a winner now. Just clicked on it. And the first winner is Crohn's Boxers. And ah, Stuart Copeland. So Stuart Copeland says, one thing I like to see in a photograph is creative use of negative space. Loving the daily vlogs, by the way. Johnny, good work. Oh, thank you very much, Stuart. Um, fantastic. So you're the first winner. You win two sets. Two sets. You win both collections um, of my final elections. Right. And who is the next winner? I'm going to take a screenshot of that page so I can get a hold of you. Uh, randomly pick a winner. Oh, Kayla! Kayla, you won! Her comment was just really funny because she was like, no Christmas themes? Thumbs down! She's a friend, and I'm pretty sure you didn't give me a thumbs down, did you, Kayla? Um, but it doesn't matter if you did, it's your choice. Um, but yeah, yay, well done, I'm so pleased. I'm really, really pleased. So Stuart and Kayla, congratulations. You both won yourself some, uh, what do you call it? Um, fine art action, so sorry guys, I'm really tired. Those hills, it was walking up the hills today. They just killed me. I was, I'm fine when I'm walking on a flat land. We are giving away both the collections to two different winners every single day, um, which I'm really happy about because it means like I get to give something out to you guys and it's all very like Christmassy and fun and giving and right up my street. I love to give back to you guys because you guys give so much to me um, just for your support and learn. And of course, if you guys, if some of you guys I know already have bought the collections, which thank you so much for that, that's amazing to have your support, then you guys can always opt to win a photograph from me instead, like a print. Um, so yeah, feel free to enter and then you can opt for either the action sets or the print. I'm happy with either, it's totally up to you. Um, yeah, so to enter you need to comment below and you can just comment anything you like really. I would love to hear what you guys are thinking about these daily videos actually. Don't forget to leave your social media details like your Instagram and stuff like that so I can get a hold of you and good luck. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and it wasn't too boring or field-y for you, you know, wandering through fields. Um, yeah, thanks. Have a great day. Take care of yourselves and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.